What's up, losers? Just kidding. Welcome back to Nellyville. If this is your first time here, go ahead and click the big red subscribe button. Give this video a big thumb. What is that? What is that? Oh my god. What is that? Hi, sisters. Ah! Ah! Almost had to come in in the day, James. <laughs> Girl, sorry, sorry. Okay, where were we? Let's let's start a rewind. What's up, you guys, and welcome back to another Every Freaking Wednesday, another spooky season part two. Go ahead, subscribe, thumbs up, post notification bell. <laughs> so what are we doing today? We're continuing on with the spooky season series. If you haven't seen video number one, go ahead and click right up here. Click right up here and uh, watch that one and then come back. Or you can watch this one and, and, and watch the first one. It's in no particular order. Okay, so welcome. Glad you're here joining us today. So what are we doing for part two? I thought we'd take a look at some makeup. You know, a little bit of Halloween glam. Everyone loves a little bit of makeup, a little... You know what I'm saying? And... You know, I do pretty good with kind of like your everyday makeup look, your everyday glam. But I wanted to really, you know, make sure you guys get some good examples. And also, I wasn't going to sit down for five hours and, and, and do all of these looks. So, I picked out some of my favorite looks from Instagram. Instagram. Hopefully they inspire you to do some nice little makeup looks. Anyways, I'm rambling. Um, let's not make this any more than what it is. For Halloween, in case you know you want to participate, do some Halloween looks without, you know, maybe you don't want to do, you know, something that's like, ah, you know what I mean? Okay, so anyway, so let's just get right into the first one. And if you don't like any of these, then go on Instagram yourself and find the looks that you like. You know what I'm saying? This is not about you, Judy. No, I'm just kidding. So the first look that we have for our Halloween inspired makeup looks is from It's Zay Baby. It's Zay Baby. And oh my gosh. So she's come up with like this nice little, and she even went all out as far as at including the wig with her look. A wig could really make a break a look. You know what I'm saying? So we have this bright, colorful skull moment. She's got the jewels. And yeah, this this is probably going to be a look that's probably for a more uh, technically skilled makeup connoisseur or artist. But I could definitely see how somebody could take this and simplify it and, and make it work. You know what I mean? Like maybe you are someone who has a little bit more experience and you you know can probably pull this off exactly but there's a way to, to dumb it down and make it simple and if you recreate this please tag me and let me know i want to see also tag miss um it's zay baby let's go on to number two okay so number two this is a, a slightly more simple look but still stunning still impactful and this is from lucky cat beauty lucky cat beauty and let me tell you okay so for one once again with the wig the wigs people uh, you know if you're not a wig person Halloween is definitely the time to become one okay to try out these different looks to really pull the whole look together so she's got the cut across bang which falls nicely with the nice fluffy flowy eyelashes and it's a it's a pretty simple look and really for being honest you could probably do this with like some walmart or target makeup if you have something that's a little more professional great not all of us do now all of us want to spend our hard-earned coins on on top of the line makeup and really honestly a lot of drugstore and walmart and kind of more of like the lower end makeup does just as good as the professional and it's just really more about body chemistry and how you pair things together but that's a different video so yeah so she has this nice pumpkin bat cat look and really honestly you could come up, show up to the party with this makeup look have a nice black dress on and call it a day okay so let's make a look number two three we have from miss yaz more makeup that's yaz more makeup and she did kind of this half pumpkin skull look you know skulls you can never you can never really go wrong make sure you're not culture appropriating with the skulls people also another video but just you know there are skulls are always just kind of a hot go-to for Halloween and this one is a little more technical as you see she has like kind of the drip uh, kind of 
effect on one side of the face so she did kind of just like a more just a regular glam with the same color palette that she used with the skull side and actually even though the jerpy part looks kind of you know hard like oh my gosh like how would I do that it's really it's not that hard there's there's many many ways that you can achieve that and really honestly if you didn't want to do the drips if you just wanted to do like the half pumpkin and half glam there's a way that you could just kind of carve out your face with like some concealer and some dark eyeshadow and have more of like a, just a clean line anyways moving on um so this look is from the wigs and makeup manager the wigs and makeup manager obviously this is a lot more than a makeup look but even if you took away all of the props and the beauty the beautifulness this will still be a very stunning makeup look that you could wear with once again just a nice little black outfit a nice little black dress have a nice shadow smoked out eye with the purple a uh, shrunken lip, red rouge on the on the cheekbones, and you could still make this work now. But if you wanted to take it to the next level, if you're trying to win the competition, this for sure would be a showstopper. I mean, the glitter down the leg, the hand pieces, the head pieces, the the gray wig. I mean, you know, it's it's a look. The spiders on the eyes, the pearl. It's this is so. This is very Lady Gaga. I'm getting very Lady Gaga glam very 2010 vibes from this look so the wigs and makeup manager stunning stunning darling okay so moving right along um five this is look that was four and this is five it doesn't matter i lost count but this is the last one so for someone who just kind of wants to do maybe you don't want to do your whole face maybe you you tend to break out or you just kind of want a time crunch but you want to participate maybe this is something you want to wear to the office so this look is from miss locks by joycelyn Sorry if I'm butchering that. Locks by Joycelyn. And her her inspo, she listed the inspo. The inspo is a cat with two heads. So that's the inspiration of this look. So this is more, this is just a very just all the fun right here on the eyelid. This is appropriate for school, for the office. If you're allowed, don't go to school and say, well, she told me. No, no, no. All I'm saying is it's not your whole face that's painted so if you wanted to do a cute little pumpkin halloween scenery on the island now you do have to get a little technical what? this is another one that you could simplify to whatever your skill level may be in the makeup uh, realm i think this is stunning it's simple but it's very impactful and it's just right here on the eye and really you could do one eye so maybe do one eye glam and didn't do the other eye with the spooky scenery the pumpkin scene i don't know this is my thought this is my opinion maybe you don't agree but i don't give a damn now i'm just like so anyways those are the makeup looks that i picked out for you guys i hope it provided a little bit of inspiration if you are inspired and you decide to recreate these looks for one tag me and for two don't forget to tag the artist that um originally created it and put them in your bios and stuff you know give credit people you know people get really touchy about sharing credit you know and i and that's important that's important i'm not knocking it you know but sometimes people just have the same idea and sometimes maybe you don't know where their ins original inspiration came from but anyways i want to see your looks if you come up with anything different or if you find some that maybe you want me to try um you know drop me a lot okay um, well, that's all I have for you guys. Don't forget to uh, subscribe, hit the thumbs up, because I know you've liked it. Come find me on all my other social media. Click the post notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a spooky video, because you don't want to miss anything on this season, right? Okay, so um, go Steelers, wear your mask, and once again, go Steelers. Yay! <laughs> Bye!